Hey, hello everyone and welcome back to the walkthrough. Let's enter the locked door and see what new challenges await us. I hope they'll be fun and they probably will be. Oh, oh, oh this is the room you need to be a wolf in. It looks like a pretty sinister room and it actually is. Watch us. We look around and just walk around and try to make some jumps. Wait, actually, am I doing this correctly? I shouldn't be doing this correctly. Ah, there we go. Yeah, that's what happens if you do this room incorrectly. But the reason why you want to be a wolf is because the spirits will lead you in the correct path. It'll They would just go wherever they're facing. And yeah, I just happened to take the right path on my first shot. Well, up until that diagonal block there. But wow. <laughs> Whoa! Yeah, just... Try not to divert your path too much in this room. Just saying. <laughs> uh, how far can I push it in this room? Okay, that seems safe enough. <laughs> Alright. Uh, I'm going to... No, wait, wait. This will be fine. I think I can make all these jumps on this. Danger... Oh, jeez. Dangerous broken staircase as a wolf. <laughs> okay, good. And now we got a battle. We've got a battle! <laughs> so let's transform into a human. Oh, it's just... Regular old Dynaphoses. Finish! Finish! Yeah! Fantastico! <laughs> I'm just gonna break apart some stuff here. Just for the heck of it. Mm, anything... Uh, I think that's where a sword would rest like in the normal decor of this place. It looks pretty broken down and gone in general. Uh, oh, that's right, I need this. And grab onto the lanterns. Wait, which is... I have to be on this side, don't I? Okay, and grab... Yeah, you can't make these jumps normally if you are... Eh. If you are in, eh, yes, that is correct. If you are in your normal form because, you know, you just can't make it. Well, that is still your normal form, but I mean without. You can't make the jumps, that's it. Ah, I'm gonna keep messing up anyway. <laughs> finish, finish! Yeah! And I won't have time to. F Wait, that other one died? Really? Why did that other one. I didn't. What? Would it have died anyway? Like, if I would have. I mean, that other one. Would the other one have died if I would have just left it. Anyway, spinner section. Okay. And spinners plus blade traps equals danger! Oh god! Oh jeez! <laughs> I must anticipate their movements a little better. Maybe I should actually pay attention to what their patterns are, like where they stop and whatnot. That one stops at about that part of the staircase. See, so I should be safe if I do that, and then go across like that, and then like that, and then like that, yeah! Alright. Is that another... Um, dark Knot over there? I think that is another Dark Knot. Oh, and uh, the treasure room of this place, I should say the treasure room of the castle, is beyond that door, which is another locked door spot. Oh yeah! The last dark nut you will ever see! Bring it on, baby. And he's just as easy as the other one, so don't worry about it. <laughs> well, you just gotta... I mean, I guess they're not... None of them are easy. But, I mean, I have to hang them to the point that they are easy enough to me. Actually, why is... This one seems to be blocking my attacks strangely well. So maybe this one's slightly harder? I... I don't know. Overhead, please. Here we go. Or maybe I just wasn't getting far enough behind him before I did my sword strikes. That may also be the case. Oh boy. <laughs> On overhead, please. Thank you. You guys aren't that hard, but you take a long time to defeat per cycle. Oh, 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 there we go. Dodge. I always like to throw that bigger sword at me just to get this swifter sword out. It doesn't really seem to matter which side you take him off balance on when he's in this form. 
when he's in Mr. Swift form. Yeah. Oh, 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 come on. <laughs> there we go. And that does it, I, I think. It should, yeah, there we go. Now over here is, as I said, the treasure room. I, I should probably put on the magic armor because it's going to give me a whole lot of rupees and I'm going to need to wait for them to cycle out. Okay. See, that, look on look on the map how many treasure chests you can see just, just in this room alone. They're so condensed. Actually, what does it look like on the map when you're actually in this room? Let's zoom in on this. Oh, Jesus Christ! <laughs> okay, so we have a bunch of stuff that we can blow up, which I think I'll do first. Well, not blow up, but I can break apart. I'll, I'll do this first, just because. Just look at that, all these little treasure chests, and there's a bunch of big ones off to the side here. <laughs> Let's plop that on. This is the last room. Oh, fairy! I guess that's nice if you need them, but I've got this. <laughs> Rare Chew Jelly, Fairy Tears, Fairy Tears, Fairy Tears. Oops, did not mean to do that. There we go. Uh, wait, wait, wasn't there? I thought I'd seen another suit of armor. Oh, whatever. All right, let's, let's start emptying out these chests, I guess. Number one! It's a blue rupee. By the way, if my... Um, my armor is too slow here, I guess I'll, uh, nah, I was gonna say, I guess I'll show you how long it takes to wait for the rupees to dwindle down, but, nah, it's, it's kind of pointless. If I have to, I'll just cut forward. Uh, so I guess this room isn't just a rupee room, I guess it's a, a resupply room of sorts as well. And, you know, I should grab that fairy before it disappears, because I'm not at, oh, I am at full health. And I don't need to scoop it. How did I get to full health? I thought I took some... Really now? <laughs> Wait, you're not gonna tell me the value of this rupee? Why not? Why are you not telling me the value of this rupee? You didn't tell me through the entire game what the value of green rupees are. But you've told me many, many times over what the value of other rupees are, so why don't you tell me what the green rupees are? I just had to get that out of my system. <laughs> and more arrows. Wow, it's five big treasure chests here. Ooh, that's a lot of rupees. Oh, ooh! You rarely see these ever in chests. That's that's kind of interesting, actually. There are the bomblings here. I bet you all my equipment is refilled. Oh my god! <laughs> so much pocket change everywhere. Seeds. Seeds. Why would they give you seeds? You don't even use the slingshot anymore. Just look at this. Even the capacity of the slingshot is less than the bow. So who would still use the slingshot? I mean, I, I guess for those Skulltulas back at the um, City in the Sky, but why? Just why would you use the slingshot still? The bow is just so much swifter and it's got a better range and everything. <laughs> I'm puzzled by that, and... <sighs> so there's my rupee count over there. I, I gotta wait until it uh, goes down to 900 before I can pick that up. <laughs> and then this room will officially be cleared out here. Mm -hmm. There we go! <laughs> da -da -da, indeed! And I will take off my armor, because that's it. Oh, I'm one rupee short of a thousand. <laughs> Just happens to be that way. It must, it must have spent one rupee over than it, uh, than I thought it did. Well, let's see if I can get my wallet to be max just before the final boss here. You Are any of these going to drop? Because I'm going to end off this part before I get into the final boss here and just do the final boss in its own part. 
It's long. I'm telling you, it's long. <laughs> really? You're not going to give me one rupee? Well, fine. Be that way. I don't care. I can get rupees anywhere else. All right. I'm going to end it off here, even if this part is kind of short. Well, it's not short by you know, normal YouTube standards, but it's just that I've been making longer parts lately, and this this feels kind of short, but I'm going to end it off here because the final boss and credits and stuff like that is going to be long, so I hope you enjoyed. I'll see you in the next part.